Hello YouTube and welcome back to another episode of The Room 2. In the last episode we started out in a very, very spooky crypt, I believe, where we- there was an angel. I'm- I'm certain somebody's gonna Doctor Who in my comments, but... <laughs> we- we picked up some mysterious little floaty black gem and now we're on a ship and we're trying to do some ship stuff, I suppose. So, we'll do this puzzle here. I assume the key goes- okay, wait. What is this? Shenanigans. Okay. Oh, I have to make the keyhole. <gasps> oh no, I'm so bad at these puzzles. Oh no. Oh no. Guys, this is not gonna go well. Oh wait, wait, wait. No, no. It's very simple. Okay. Got it. Key. Turn the key. Oh, very nice. Okay, okay. So, um, passage to the cape took us four miles west. Um, and we soon sighted her mass four miles to the north. Um, seeing in pursuit, we went west two miles. Go! Yeah! Nice. Um, we have her now. The fog lifted shortly before noon, and there she was, six miles to the south. Rapidly, we chased her- we closed her down, and she fled east two miles back towards the cape. Now she lies ahead of us north by just one mile. She won't reach the cape again. And it's shiny, so we can use the meat that- oh my god. I am on a boat. Motherfucker. I'm on a boat. Okay, what is this? Perspective? Can I go in here? What is this nonsense? I do not understand. Oh! <gasps> what? Am I steering a tiny boat? She was six miles to the south? South, so... Uh... We need to turn pretty far, right? Turn, boys, turn! Oh, what's that? Oh, there's something there. Bammo! No, 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 go back. little bit just just turn a little bit easy 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 bam did it what happened oh god oh god oh okay cool very neat all right um i like that little boat okay uh six miles to the south five six uh east two miles and north one mile Pop. Yeah, buddy. Oop! There we go. Womp. It's just a boat. It's just a sea. <gasps> Hello! Hi. A painted figurehead. Thanks. Ah! My head was in there. That's dangerous. Oh, no spookles. Don't do that. No. Okay, I assume she goes in the boat. Uh, they're usually at the front, right? Just put her at the at the front. Where did these things go? Oh, there we go. Yump. Too spoopy. Okay. Um, a model ship's wheel. Okay. Well, I assume it goes on top. Just over here. Womp. Oh, we can turn it. Oh, we can turn it. What is this? What is this? Oh my god. <gasps> the masts. What does that do? Oh, why are there two wheels? We need another jam. I forgot about that. A code. Alright, well it's probably on this dude, so. Rose. Gotcha. Rose. R. O. Down. D down. Not roll. That's an L. Okay, Rosa. Rose. 
Oh, it's so cool. Thank you for my gem. All right, and then we put the gem on here. Yeah. Getting it, boys. Uh, okay, there's a note here. Let's read the note. It is the natural tendency of this world to twist itself into ever more elaborated arrangements. Like the spirals of a vortex, at once both the pattern and the system. It seems as though each room itself is a part of a wider apparatus. You must tune the room to find the glyph, and tune the glyph to find the door. All must be aligned, but to what purpose? Am I the explorer? The prisoner? Don't ask me that kind of shit, man. Okay, wait, there's another note, I believe, here. The Santa Helena came apart on rocks at 1800 hours. She heaved as if the bottom had been torn from her and began taking on water at a terrible rate. Only there were no rocks. We approached as close as we dared to try and take on survivors, but only one swam clear of the wreckage. He is some sort of scholar. A wide-eyed wreck of a man in tattered, blood-stained ragged rags. Clutched in his white-knuckled fist was some sort of sculpture that he babbled was of unimaginable power and worth. It seems our prize may have not gone with the Helena. Could the scholar have been my- the dudes that leaving the notes for me? Hello. Oh, wait. Okay. Hmm, what do we got? Okay, we have, like, some stuff out here. Can I do anything with this guy? No, clearly not. So let's put this on the scale. Um, wait. What are- wait, what is this deal? Can I put it here? Hmm. What can I do with this thing? Uh. Hmm. Can I do anything here? How about here? Okay, no. So let me zoom in here again. Uh. Can I put it on here? Whoops, let me. Okay, it's just, it's just a weight. Nautical measures, uh, R, Shaw, and Co. Falmouth. Okay. Is this a, a thingy? Is this a doodad? Oh, there we go, there we go. Must be a doodad if I, okay, I am zoomed in. What? Buddy? Oh. Can I put the weight on here now? Ah, Jesus, okay. Hmm. All right. Okay, what are you? I need a piece that goes there, I guess. What are you? A small disc. How convenient. I need one of those. I'm assuming he goes here. And I turn him so that piece can slide down. Like this. Oh. Oh, another weight. Okay. This one is shaped like a square, so I assume he goes on this. Okay. Cool. Oh, oh, can I take this guy? Yeah, alright. I got this on lockdown. Come now, where are the puzzles at? Oh, wait. Can I? Okay, I can do this kind of thing. Yeah. Awesome. Okay, hi. Alright, and that's the hexagon, which goes on to that guy. Like that. Like that. Like here. Game, what do you want? Should I get closer? Okay, like this, maybe. What does this look like? It's not even showing me. It, it's definitely the hexagon, so... I guess it's not a hexagon, is it? No, that's a hexagon. It's six sides. What the hell? Is it a triangle? What, it, what do you want, game? Oh, this can turn. Oh. Oh, look at that. 
Okay, so now it is a triangle. Alright, so I was just fucking up. I'm too silly. Sorry about that. Got it. But where is the circle piece? Hmm. Okay. But now I don't have a piece that I need to complete this part. So, I'm trying to find a circle. Can I click on that at all? No. Hmm. Can I fiddle with this at all? No, I need to fiddle with this guy, but... Hmm, no circle means I'm looking in the wrong place. Oh, is that a tiny drawer? Excuse me, I see you. What? Oh, something seems to be stopping. Yes, yes. I need to turn these dudes. What? Oh. Can I not mess with those? Oh. So that must be for later. Are there any more other hidden drawers that I should know about? Hmm. Hmm. Alright, alright. Nothing to panic about. Just gotta take a look-see here. And try to... Figure out exactly... Okay, wait. What is this? There's like a little, a little line down the middle of this one. Can't click on it though. Alright, I'm missing something. Okay, this is lit up. Can I go over here? No. Can't go anywhere else. Just have this table. So it's got to be on the table somewhere. But where? I'm looking. Believe you me, I'm looking for this thing. Okay. Okay. I did it after a good old 15 minutes. We'll go a little bit longer than usual because I took so long to figure that out. All right, the drawer should be open now, right? Yeah, okay. And there's the wait. All right. Okay, for everybody that knew that that was there, I apologize. Jesus. Okay, okay. That took me forever. Bam. 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 Is that going to fit? No, it's not gonna fit. Go back. Go back. I needed to... No, go back. I need... Oh. Oh, what shenanigans. Oh, this is straight up shenanigans. Alright, okay. So they fit here. Oh, no, we're fine, we're fine. Alright, never mind. I thought I had to figure something. I was I was overcomplicating, just like the thing with the drawer. Alright. So is this truly a square? Okay. Apparently it is not. I'm glad I checked before running around freaking out. Alright. And now it appears to be the star shape. This this scale is incredibly one sided. Nice. Alright, a deity. Well, shit, where am I going to get the next circle piece? I didn't even think about that. Uh. Well. Okay, we already opened the drawer. That mystery has been solved. What do we got? Anything showing underneath the scale now? Nothing is inside these holes here. Hmm. Where am I going to get another circle piece? It's gotta be here somewhere. Gotta be. I will find it. I have a unique set of skills, and none of them are video game rela oh, related. So I'll, I'll take a minute here. Let me see. I don't see anything on the outside of this, this table. I truly, really don't. 
Then again, my eyes are really bad. I'm using my spares because my prescription needed some work done, so... Hmm... Hum -num 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 Hang on, whoa, 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 whoa. What is this? That's a hinge, if I ever saw one, right? Can I move it? No. I thought perhaps I could lift that. Alas, I was wrong. Wait. This one's higher. <gasps> There's an arrow! I didn't even see you! Alright. Ah, ha, 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 ha. Of course. Never fool me. Mm -mm -mm. I didn't totally spend, like, forever thinking about where that goes. I got it. Mm, I got it in my head. Locked and loaded. Here we go. No. Oh, lordy. Oh, bless my soul. Stop. Stop. You're moving way too fast, little slidey do. Alright. Got it. You have to get up pretty early in the morning to fool me. As I always say. And it's never true. Alright. You look like you move. Something here moves. You can't fool me. There's an arrow. Can I turn you? Yes, I can. Oh, I got another weight. Oh, that's the hexagon. And then a little circle weight. Okay. Hexagon. Oh, nothing happened? Okay. And then circle. And then circle. And they touch. Make them kiss. Okay, bye. Bye. Goodbye. Oh. Look, a little anchor. A small anchor. And a metal clock spring. Very nice. Alright, what do we got? Some kind of box. Oh, what are you? Oh. So what am I trying to do here? Probably nothing right now because I can't move those. Okay. Let's take a look at this. What is this about? I need some kind of piece. This is clearly something. But what? Okay. Oh! Oh! A small flat-headed screwdriver, okay. Was there anything with screws? These? Nah. Oh, this. This right here. Oh, these aren't flat-headed screws, huh? No, no. No can do, Lauren. That's not the right kind of screwdriver. Hmm. Well, in that case, I didn't even look at the top. What's going on here? Well, snap, crackle, pop, rice, krispies, boys. All right, let's see. What is this dude about? I can hardly move my camera. I seemingly cannot move those pieces inside. Not you, Siri. I cannot move those pieces inside. All I can move is this doodad. And that does not help in the slightest. Okay. Let's focus on what we know. I have a screwdriver. Can't use it in that situation. Is there something here I can unscrew? What is this nonsense? Okay. Focus, Lauren. You gotta focus now. You gotta hone that brain muscle. But, what I do have is a spring. Can I put the spring anywhere? Can I put the anchor anywhere? I didn't even think. <gasps> the anchor! Can it go on the model ship? First, let's look at that. Okay, ship. Ship, do you need an anchor? How about right here? <gasps> an anchor! 
Yeah! And then we get this piece. Awesome. Okay. Cool. Progression. I see. Now we will go back to the box. Turn this guy around. Zoom in and kerplunk. And turn it. And it opens. Alright, what do we got? Oh, I have a spring. Where does it go? Probably behind the clock. I don't have very much knowledge of how clocks works, honestly. Hello. A winding key. I know you have to wind them. Every day or something like that, every week. Where do you go, in here? Oh wait, does the key go in here? No, the key goes on the front. Right here. Okay, oh. Oh. Okay. Am I doing anything right now? No, I'm not. What is this guy then? Can I put you on there? Can I wind you? Oh, I can turn it. Okay. Oh, now we have access to the back fa the the back side of the clock. Okay. What is this? I don't know. Oh. <gasps> and it opens. Just like that. All right, very rusty. Very rusty, but that's all right. We have stuff to work with. Okay, the key. I will need to block out that Skype name. It won't wind up something's missing. You mean a spring? Oh wait, the flathead screw jet. No, 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 the flathead screw jet. There you go. There we go. Open this bad boy, put in the winding piece, and then uh, we can wind it. Oh. Okay. Now what? What good does that do me? Okay, what does this do? Nothing. Oh, a tiny key goes in here. Hmm. Oh, what is this? Oh. <gasps> it's turning now. 250. Oh, I forgot about that thing. Okay, 250. All right. We'll set it to 250. Backwards. Two. Nope, stop. D. That is not 250. 250. Button. Button. Yeah! Yeah! Oh, I want that key. How do I get them to stop? What? Up oh, there we go. I'm gonna spam it. Oh, it stops it if I hold it. Okay. A key. I know where it goes. It goes up here. Okay. Oh. Well, what do we have here? Oh, it's a boat. Or this paste needle, but most likely a boat. Okay. And you are a diamond shaped metal casing. Oh, bye. And I assume we put it right up on top of here. Hello. Let's do it. Alright, I think this is like the end of this chapter. Ooh. Okay, okay. Perspective. Wow. Alright, we can do this real quick. This episode's long, I know it is, but I did flub up trying to figure out some of these puzzles. Nice. Ah! No, 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 no. 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 
No! I don't wanna! Ooh. Oh, it's creepy. You finally, you have successfully navigated the secrets of the ship, yet this grim ordeal will become increasingly challenging. That was hard, so I don't want it to get harder. <laughs> My goosebumps. Oh! Hmm. Okay. Alright. We're done with that, but anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. We're gonna end this episode here. Sorry I went kind of long, but uh, I'm really enjoying this game, and I wanted to finish the chapter, because I don't really want to end, like, in the middle of stuff. I don't know. It's it's hard to chop up this game, because there's no telling how long it'll take me to figure stuff out, and there's no telling how funny my commentary will be when I'm stuck, so... <laughs> I have to give leeway. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please leave me a like or a comment down below the video, and if you enjoyed me, then please subscribe today for some more in the future. Guys, 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 guys. Please, oh please, check out the developers of this game, Fireproof Studios, they made The Room, and of course, the 2 and 3, and they are just fan, diddly dang tastic people, so please check out their website, please check out the game's website, and then check out the Steam Store page where you can purchase this game, which is about 5 US dollars on Steam. It's fantastic for what you pay, it, it's amazing, I'm not gonna lie, this is, this is fantastic, so please check it out if you have the chance, guys, and yes. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Have a fantastic day, night, wherever you are out there. And please stay safe. Much love to your faces. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye. Do I have a choice? Not really. They have crisp drop edges for grip bevel edges that have perfect fit. The quality metal is amazing. They never twist on the hoof. Ryan, please. <laughs> it's really fascinating.